Everybody community is deeply saddened by some of the news that's been coming out of, of Colorado Springs. And the hearts of the firefighters go out to all those affected by wildland fires, not just in Colorado Springs, but El Paso County and, uh, you know, communities all across Colorado and the West. Um, that said, our focus remains on this fire, the Waldo Canyon fire. And as Jerry said, the firefighters made really good progress last night. No perimeter growth at all to report. No additional structures lost or damaged. So we're feeling really good about that. Um, I'll show you on the map a few of the things that we, we have specifically to share with you. For the first time, you can start to see those black containment lines showing up here along the Highway 24 corridor. This is fire perimeter that is contained. And we are confident that that is a solid barrier and there will be no spread of the fire over those black areas. The indirect line that I talked to you about yesterday, the Plumas Hotshot crews, I talked to their supervisor this morning, and they are confident that they will be able to get this portion of the line in today. This line here along Rampart Range Road and up and around the reservoir held last night with no movement at all. This contingency line here, <laughs> several of them remain in place as we speak we're still confident here moving around this way the spot fires that we had that came across the reservoir those spot fires have been lined we have crews on them as we speak dozers crews and aerial assets committed to those coming into here and following what i call the power line runs but i think it's mechanic creek as well um, firefighters are making progress on that from both sides the maps and other aircraft were used along this ridge line to hold the fire up there, and the fire had no spread as a result of those aerial activities that we had. Working around this way, we have crews in all this area trying to connect it down to here. Um, this line construction is going fairly well. Um, we are a little concerned still because the weather forecast, this is where we're on the receiving end of the winds that we do get. They're supposed to be lighter today, but this will be uh, a, a focus because of the wind direction for the day. Mop-up efforts and, and, and work in here continues to be successful as well as coming on around in here. We still have that one pocket here above Cave of the Winds that I've told you about and we're not too confident or uh, not, not able to get ground troops in on. We're confident we can keep it there with aerial resources, but we got definite eyes in the sky on this, this particular place there. So the focus for the day is to hold what we got, improve the lines that we have in place, use aerial assets as necessary to support the troops on the ground, and bring in the heavy equipment where we can to um, further enhance our ability to put muscle down on the ground in front of this fire and keep it in its, its containment lines.